The Spectator Index, a Twitter account with a whopping 2.4 million followers, just loves to post fake news about China. Check out this tweet and video, which has attracted 3.7 million views so far, as well as more than 10,000 likes. It reads, Chinese surveillance system instantly deducts fine from account of speeding driver. The problem? Well, that's not at all what the video shows. And speed cameras in China have absolutely no ability to automatically deduct money from anyone's account. The video actually shows a company testing speed cameras in southern China's Shenzhen. Again, they rely on the fact that the vast, vast majority of their users cannot read Chinese. So let's take a closer look. In the video, we see the first clue that the claim is fake. It says here that the speed limit on this major road has been set to 20 kilometers an hour. Now we all know that is an extremely low speed limit, so why would it be so low? Well, keep watching. Then the video pans to the right and shows the license plates of passing cars being clocked for speeding. Now all I had to do to debunk this lie was note down the account number of the account over at Douyin, which is China's version of TikTok. It takes us to this account of a Shenzhen company called Shenzhen Sukur Lighting Technology Development Co. Limited. What a mouthful. So what does the company do? Well, you guessed it, it makes and sells technology that monitors speed limits across China. A major part of their company is testing, basically going to sites to calibrate and ensure the accuracy of speed cameras they sell. Now, going back to the video that the Spectator Index posted with these facts in mind, it's clear to see that the company are testing their speed camera, which is why they've temporarily set the speed limit to a very low 20 kilometers per hour, which allows them to check if the system is accurately recording quote unquote speeding vehicles. In this instance, the vehicles in question are not actually breaking the law and will not receive a fine in the mail. On top of that, China is just like most other countries when it comes to speed camera fines. They are sent to the registered owner of the vehicle in question, who then has a set time to either appeal or pay the fee. The government does not have the ability to automatically deduct fines from people's bank accounts. So you guys, think twice before you fall for fake China bad stories next time.